Hey, Dimitri. Um, I'm really enjoying the uh, iteration on the Quantent boss kind of arena and and Quantent uh, herself as well, right? So I was taking a look at this, and I think, uh, just so you know, like I, I'm really, um, really enjoying the, what is that? I think it's because it's marquee tool. I don't know. Like new, new Photoshop is weird. Things aren't quite working the way I want them to. Um, but uh, so I was taking a look at this here, right? Thinking again about how the camera is going to come up basically probably through the middle. Um, we have all this great reveal. I'm really enjoying, um, I think, the enormity of the environment. Um, one of the things we probably want to keep in mind is, uh, I think, you know, again, where the camera is at, right? Because this is a uh, much bigger, I mean, we can certainly maybe scale the environment down a bit more um, to, uh, to account for this in terms of details. But I think that's part of what we need to do is experiment with like, hey, okay, how is the camera going to move through the scene and what are you actually looking at at that point? So I really like the way the, the, uh, the shot uh, appears at the top um, here. So I'm something like this is probably what I'm thinking about. So this is great. This is a super great fra framing for, I think, the, the boss themselves. Um, how the boss is connected to the machine to some degree. Um, and uh, I think, you know, that that's good. So that feels really good. I think there we're getting um, better at um, probably the, the sizing. She probably could be a little bit bigger um, in this particular case. But again, kind of us thinking about that, right? So um, I really like the the idea of this stuff, of course, um, and, and uh, like the, the uh, you know, the, I don't know, the projector data stream thing that we got going on. Um, and the way that's connected. So uh, some other bits here that are probably, let me get off this marquee tool. Um, can I, how do I turn off the marquee tool? What is this? Oh, deselect maybe? Yeah, okay, it's, it's probably the escape key. Uh, again, photo, new Photoshop, so. Uh, so I think one of the things that, uh, that I, I, wanna, I wanna think about a little bit more here is I want to get the sense of a lot of depth into the background. Um, and I think with the, the current wrap that we have with our, our kind of background, um, that it's, it's too close. The whole thing is, is too enclosed. Um, and so I really want to, and maybe it's, and again, I, I'm not the artist necessarily, so I'm trying to illustrate. I think like kind of like if we push it all the way back, we can still keep some of the curvature, but also, um, design a much deeper, uh, I think, image in this particular case. Um, and I think coming back to maybe, coming back to, where are we at, daddy? Um, over here, there we go. Uh, and I think I mentioned this in, in the last bit here too, right? So, uh, do, 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 do. <clears throat> so one of the things I like about each one of these images uh, is the fact that we have, and granted, uh, this is probably the closest, right? But I, I could see us having sort of our wrapped like walls. Um, but I really want this like this idea of this mega industrial kind of complex. Um, and I think that that's kind of what I'm 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 kind of still drawn towards. I really want the feel of enormity, a giant like machine space, um, almost like a space station. Like there are people in this place, right? That you know, automatons and robots and like all that good stuff, right? Um, and I think uh, in order to do that, we need to get we need to push much further into the background um, into, in, you know, in the way that we're, we're setting up the shot. So that's pretty much the main piece of feedback there on that side. Um, otherwise, just honorable mentions. I'm, I'm really enjoying, again, like, the, I, like, like kind of these shapes here, um, sort of the idea of like these, uh, you know, the, the circuitry and like kind of these big data blocks, right? This is sort of like a quantum intelligence mainframe of sorts, right? Like a super, super machine computer, right? And I guess you don't have to say machine and computer. Maybe you can, I don't know, like a, <laughs> a quantum computer. Um, and I, I like kind of the tech noise that we've got going on there and what that looks like. So uh, with that in mind, uh, I think that was a bit of feedback there. And then you wanted to take, you wanted me to take a look at the new Quantum. So I haven't, uh, haven't uh, looked at her in detail. So why don't we do this right now? We'll get first impressions. Um, there we go. Yes. Yes. All right. Mm-hmm. Let me try. Mm, mm, mm. All right, let's take a look at her. So you went with the yellow a little bit in the face, huh? What was that in terms of coloring in the, the previous version? Uh, oh yeah, oh, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, okay, I see what it was. That was probably my, my bad there. So I only wanted to take the green eyes and I want to keep this flesh tone. So um, here, 
keep the keep the flesh tone here. And then um uh, yeah, so only the uh, the eyes, I think the yeah, because the, the yellow face wasn't quite. So, sorry about that. Um, yeah, so uh, let's see here. Only green eyes. All right, cool. Um, I really like where we're at with her. Oh, good. Um, we also taking a look at the the kind of feminine shape a bit more here. Uh, I say I like how you did a little bit of the accents. Um, yeah, I wasn't quite going with the gold android uh, flavor, so I think we can come back to um, let's see what was that. Yeah, so I really I, I want to go with the accents of the the purple bits which you have. That's great. Purple hair is pretty awesome. The blue hair is really awesome too. That's a tough. It's a tough one. Um, why don't we Why don't we do a mix where we check real quick on um, on what the blue hair looks like, uh, and then uh, do the accents. The because I think here too we have the in terms of like the flesh tones. I, yeah, I want to see the. Uh, I want to see the. I want to see kind of I really like these purple accents that we've got going on so that that I really want to carry that through um, with a little bit of the flesh tones in the face the the piercing green eyes um, and then uh, you know again we've updated our shape which is great um, yeah so let's do a remix of those things uh, just to see where we're at with that all right cool um, I, I can probably let's see here uh, Just shove that up there for a sec. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> well, I did make you do a boob shape. Uh, you know, like we. So the feedback from the, the previous version was that these these breast shapes were were looking uh, wrong. So um, and so I I, I put into Dimitri the hey let's let's uh, see if we can update our our feminine form. Um, and uh and yeah i mean it's it's everything's all very silly right so um i do like the shape much better which is great i think yeah i think that it's good to see the sizes so thank you for that because i think that you know like i didn't want to go super caricature but i wanted to just do giant caricatures so we could have like a you know compare and contrast but i think this is cool because I'm seeing some of the uh, the suit designs. Man, these abs are great. Oh my god, I love this. I love this so much. This is so good. Um, as in, this is so good. I mean, the whole torso is great, by the way. I think I I am enjoying the size here, uh, or the the uh, design here. Oh, get at it there. Add new Photoshop. <laughs> Um, yeah, so I, th I think I like the, the shape and design there. I do, I do like that we have kind of, um, uh, like there is, it's almost like a, like the, the harder, the, the softer shapes here reminds me of the cloth. I do like that design though with, yeah, interesting. Yeah, I think I like it. I like it better without the the dress, the the dressing around it, which is great. Um, it kind of re reinforces the, the the kind of shape of the synthetic body, which is super cool. Um, yeah. Otherwise, I mean, con content really came out nicely. I, I'm really liking where we're at. Um, I'm enjoying the designs on the face. That's kind of interesting. I think we go there. I, I mean, yeah. And then let's get a re a slight remix on the coloration. So let's take a look at her again. Oh, it's cool. Yeah. So you also um, chose, I didn't even notice that. So you chose kind of what I chose too. So I love it. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I wonder. Kind of looking at the, the inner pieces where they're, um, let's, let's try, a, why don't we try something crazy too, where um, let's, just do a version where we um, get a hard brush here. Uh, doo, doo, doo. God, what is this? There is something that I am doing. Is it B, the brush? I don't know, man. Oh, again, new Photoshop. 
Uh, let's try a version where um where and uh, let's try the inner bits where they're just maybe like they're they're bright and glowing. You know, I just want to see kind of what that looks like. Um, maybe it turns out it doesn't work at all. But just just went since we're doing coloration anyways. Um, let's just do a test where um, we try kind of a bright and glowing side of things there. But um, otherwise, I really like where we're at. So yeah, so let's try the uh, next version. Let's try the blue hair. Let's do the uh, the skin color remix back to the the more uh, more flesh tone that you had uh, previously. Uh, only green eyes. Try the glowy bits uh, and then remix from there. So yeah, this is great. Um, I'm looking forward to chatting with you tomorrow. And uh, thank you so much for all the work. Talk to you later.